Hey there, and welcome to Game Theory, the show that I'm plagiarising for April Fool's Day. You know, on my channel we like to ask the big questions, and today we're going to ask the biggest one of all. Rayman's penis, is it attached or detached? We're going to explore a lot of possibilities and learn a lot about Rayman in the process. But enough of the boring stuff, let's get right into the meat of the situation. Rayman's meat, to be precise. Rayman has had a radically different set of games, from 2D platformers, to 3D platformers, to repetitive minigames distracting us from the rabid overlords, right back to 2D platformers, with a brand new gorgeous art style. But strangely enough, Rayman's potentially enormous dong and set of tings next to it are nowhere to be seen. I wonder why. Does the 3 plus E for everyone rating have anything to do with it? Yeah, probably. I do believe the series has revealed the answer over time, so we'll dive right into the urethra and uncover the mysteries. Fuck, that was gross. We'll start with debunking some theories. No, his propeller hair is not his penis. I mean, it's clearly hair. I'm sure he can wave his dick around like his hair and use it to hover just as well, but uh, no, that's hair. His nose is not his penis either. It's big, sure, but a chode it is not. Sneezing does feel like a face orgasm though. I could go in depth about how it could be as sensitive as his nipples. His nose likes a nice blow and tickle, but that's for another time. There's also the idea that his tongue is his penis. In Rayman 1, the hunters run away when he pulls a face at them, revealing his tongue. The hoodlums also get scared back into redlums at the sight of this. If his tongue is his penis, he could actually be scaring them and scarring them because he's a flasher. But no, that's not the case. He would have penis breath all the time. And someone would bring that up. Rude or not, someone would. Moving on from the silly ideas, to discover the truth, I think we have to ask the question of what is Rayman? Well, according to the wiki, Rayman is depicted as a limbless humanoid with floating appendages, which he can throw at enemies to attack them. According to the Rayman Origins trailer, Rayman is a thingamajig, though this might just be a joke and is essentially a limbless human. In Rayman 1, in the Blue Mountains level, Mr. Stone's Peaks, we see other people just like Rayman, including a baby, meaning that yes, they do have penises and vaginas. People who are like Rayman can reproduce. They are wearing clothes and a nappy, so it's hard to see where it could be. It's possible it could be attached, but have the same traits as a chameleon. It changes colour to its environment so others can't see it. However, in another section of Rayman 1, we see in the dream forest, in a level called the Swamps of Forgetfulness, there's a man called Terezan who's hidden behind a set of flowers, hiding until we get his clothes back. So it's certainly not camouflage. But is this the answer? Is it just hidden within his clothes? Well, flaccid or not, there would be a bulge, even with the smallest penis. Where's Rayman's bulge? Regardless, it still doesn't tell us if it's attached or not. However, I have another theory. The TV show Once Upon a Time is obviously a work of fiction by the brilliant Edward Kitsis and Adam Horowitz, but what if I told you that that show actually hints at what may have happened in the real world? In Once Upon a Time, a curse is placed upon the Enchanted Kingdom, and characters we remember, like Snow White and Rumpelstiltskin, to name just two, are placed in a completely separate world devoid of most magic. They don't have their memories anymore, and even people like Ariel from The Little Mermaid are now human. So why did I bring all this up? What if I told you a curse was placed upon the Glade of Dreams, just like the one in Once Upon a Time? Rayman is now in our world with no memory of his past and has complete human features. No detached limbs. Nitro Rad is a popular reviewer on YouTube and he is excellent. But don't you think he looks a lot like a human version of Rayman? He seems to wear the same hoodie a lot. I mean, he could have just bought it. Or maybe he arrived with it. Need more proof? Rayman Legends is the last Rayman game to be released, with its releasing on August 29th, 2013. Nitro Rad created his YouTube account on November 17th, 2013. That's right, I put it to you. Very shortly after the events of Rayman Legends, a curse was placed upon the land and Nitro Rad is indeed Rayman. He woke up and wanted to be a YouTuber. 
Congratulations on making it a reality. Now we just need to work out how to fix the curse and we can send him back and Rayman 4 can get released. Anyway, back to the subject of Nitro Rad's penis. There's a promotional piece of art for Rayman 3 of Rayman going to a urinal. I am not making this up, but it shows that Rayman has a penis. We can see he doesn't have a zip at the front, so for him to conceal it, it must be at the bottom of his hoodie. For him to be pissing that way, it must be moved from the bottom to the front, and there is no way it would be long enough to get that far, and therefore must be detached. There you go, case closed! Now, the more pressing question here is, why would you put your hand on the wall of that bathroom? Men's bathrooms are fucking disgusting, and I actively avoid going to them. Why don't you just drink those guys' piss while you're at it? Moving onwards from that, though, a little later, unfortunately for Rayman, I think his penis was eaten by this thing. In Rayman 1, he didn't kill it, and whilst walking through the Forest of Dreams, reminiscing on days where he had a different art style, he came across this lippy plant monstrosity again, and it ate his penis. Can he feel it? Is it like a never-ending blowjob? I don't know! But this does mean Nitro Rad may not have a penis anymore. Really sorry to hear that, dude. This is my own head cannon, please do not steal. Thank you very much for watching the video! Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, share the video around, support the Patreon, Twitch, Twitter, become a YouTube member, tell me how many times I said the word penis in this video, penis, 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 and also tell Nitro Rad about this video so we can get Rayman 4 to be released. Seriously though, <laughs> Nitro Rad, if you're watching, I'm sorry, and I love your videos. <laughs> Have a great day everyone, happy April Fools, take care, bye bye. <laughs>